Hello, my name is Ty Tabbitt with Signature Offset, and today I'm going to be going over a problem that we see from time to time that involves spot color and transparency and some overprint problems. Um, what you might see is you see some graphics that drop out or maybe a text box that has a drop shadow on it um, where the background turns white when you intended it to be transparent. Uh, this is a problem that's associated with InDesign having difficulties um, with transparent objects that affect spot colors. So the first way, the first thing to start with is to actually view the problem and to do that in Acrobat 11 you can go under the tools menu and go down to print production and select the output preview and first I'm just going to show you where the, where the problem arises. So if uh, you have this checkbox up here, simulate overprinting, I'm going to just turn this off and you'll see that these four images across the middle disappear. And this is an example of what can happen and where this problem arises. So um, I'm going to turn it back on and uh, kind of explain what's happening here. Uh, this background here is, is actually one of these Pantone colors over here. And these four images across the middle are images that I applied an opacity reduction of like 85%, which is making them semi-transparent. And you can see that. See the background is kind of showing through. Um, that is the problem that InDesign has where transparent objects sitting on top of a spot color has some difficulty applying the overprints in the PDF. And the scary part about this is it looks and appears okay um, in the PDF and oftentimes in, in InDesign as well. But uh, only when this is separated into four color um, and the overprint is applied do we see problems like this happening where the images are dropping out. So real good idea to open your PDFs up check this simulate overprinting make sure that uh, you don't have anything weird happening in the PDF and also keep an eye and make sure you don't have any additional spot colors now to fix this we'll uh, go ahead and go into InDesign and I'll show you how to fix it and then we'll come back into Acrobat and uh, take a look at the results okay so now we're in the original InDesign document and we're going to be fixing this problem we have with these these four images that have transparent their transparency on top of a spot color. Now the first way to to resolve this problem would be to just open up the color options of the spot colors you have in the document and just convert these color types from spot to process and and that would resolve it. Make, you know making sure your color mode is in CMYK uh, and on process. Um, and I, I recommend doing that really when you're building anything if you're if you're printing in CMYK um, so there's no additional conversion that ha has to happen at the printer um, so that's good practice to do however oftentimes you don't have access to the original InDesign document there might be PDFs that are submitted to you and they have Pantone colors in them so oftentimes people don't know how to exactly fix that and you can fix that during the PDF conversion process and to do that we'll go under you know the file menu like you're getting ready to make your PDF Go to Adobe PDF Presets, down to PDF X 1A 2001. Click Save. And under the Export window, there's an option for Output. Go ahead, click that, and then click on the Ink Manager right here. And you want to check down here, All Spots to Process. And what that's going to do is that's going to convert all those additional spot colors into the process color mode, which will resolve this, this problem we see. So I'm going to click OK. And now I'm going to go ahead and export this PDF, and then I'll open the PDF back up in Acrobat, and we can view the results. OK, so now we're back in Acrobat 11, and I have the, P the new PDF I just created. Uh, when we check the All Spots to Process option, it converted all those spot colors into CMYK and you can see that by in my output preview menu here all those spot colors that were in the, the first video we looked at uh, they're gone that's because they've been converted to CMYK and now when I uncheck my simulate overprint um, when I uncheck this these images won't be affected see I can uncheck that 
and they, they're still there. So the problem has been resolved, and uh, that's a really good way to fix this. I would, if um, opening up any PDFs that are submitted to you as ads or anything, um, I'd open them up in Acrobat and check to see if they do have additional spot colors. So then when you place those in your InDesign document, you can uh, check those um, all spots to process option to resolve this issue. So I hope that helped you out with this problem uh, we see from time to time. And uh, make sure to check us out on at signatureoffset.com under support. We've got a lot of training videos there. And also on Facebook, just search Signature Offset. And we'll be posting more additional helpful training videos from time to time. Thanks a lot.